Your scouts have discovered a rival war band in the vicinity. These warriors are clustered around their wagon, making them a very attractive target. Super clustered. All right, what do we got? What do we got? Who are they? Okay, all of the weird stones over here, and we need to, for the bonus objective, we need 50% of the weird stone. They are the Sisters of Sigmar. Okay. Um, nom nom be. How fast the necromancer is. How bad his old man syndrome happens to be. Alright, let's do it. The twin tailed comet is the witch hunter symbol. Okay, redeem units? Yes. Thought that was the Sisters of Sigmar symbol. Pens in hand. Alright, slow zombies walking. As you can see, I have a zombie named Girly Jankles. Uh, is that a redeemable stream action with these points? Uh, yeah, just do the rename hero option. Steve the player. <laughs> Alright. Sounds good. Steve! Freaking... Okay, well that's not great. So he's gotta he's gotta say freaking vampire lords are so fast. It's just And then their zombies are so slow. <laughs> uh our dudes together. Alright, so he has okay speed. <laughs> Look at his freaking... <laughs> what the... <laughs> the heck is that crap? <laughs> Look at his freaking cape. <laughs> Like a potato sack that was a person at some point, it looks like. I like how detailed the face is, though. I don't I don't feel like that face would be so detailed if it was just like hanging off of each. <laughs> the one flapping arm. <laughs> just so freaking silly looking. It's like it's the cape of skin. Don't worry about it. It's fine. I probably could have had my friggin' vampire lord pray at the wagon before he ran off at 800,000 miles an hour. That way we could have picked up some more of this weird stone without, with less chance of getting messed up by it. At least we have a necromancer that likes to pick up weird stone, and a rat boy as well who is better at it. Do, 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 do. 
Uh, so yeah, I can't uh, I can't rename. A new round has started. At least I don't think I can rename in the middle of the battle, so uh, I have to wait till after the battle's over. But uh, we'll get your we'll get your name in. Any unit you specifically want to be renamed? Like, do you want a zombie or a ghoul or uh, vampire lord is currently renamed already. I do have another one though, but he's just he's not the active lord at the moment. The off lord. <laughs> the dude that takes over. The night manager <laughs> takes over when my other guy's training. On vacation. Or I guess it's vampire, so he would be the day manager. Can we see anybody yet? Have we spotted any, any of these dudes? No, they haven't gotten close enough yet. There's one. I gotta be careful how close I get here. Before my other guys can get up to support. Maybe I'll stop like right here, like on top of the weird stone, basically. Just gotta chill on the pile. If this guy can get up there and start taking some weird stone, we're gonna do that. Ooh, it looks like we just get there. Let's get the objectives updated. Get that cluster, yo. Get it. Not take the negative effect from it either. Objectives updated. Oh. Rolled poorly that time. What did he get? Uh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> His melee charge attacks cost him more because he'll be doing that a whole lot <laughs> for sure. Definitely gonna be happening all the time. Non stop melee charge attacks. Let's put her over here. Move my zombie through over here. This guy with his very, very strange fashion sense over here. And she, okay, here she comes. This is my warp stone pile. You can't have it. Freaking Steve the Pirate. Necromancer over here. I mean... I'm not sure. I'm, I don't think I feel like I'm in a... in a position to criticize him all that much. Warp enfeeblement. Barbara. Divine retaliation? Don't point at me. Rebuke? What are you doing? Stop doing things. You're doing so many things. I don't know what any of them are. <laughs> Madam, please. Contain yourself. A new round has started. Sweet. Alright. 
Well, they're giving me time to get my zombies moved up, so that's good. Probably just keep chilling here. Activate his trap card. I feel like he just played his entire deck. <laughs> Suddenly, just like drops everything on the table. Just like what? What? <laughs> Doesn't explain any of it. Just says you lose. <laughs> bum, 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 bum. Alright, high forts. Um, let's see. If we get a little bit closer, we could probably pitch a poison globe out here. Hit, maybe hit both of them? Yep, there we go. Nice. And it, that way it is in that gap as well. Let's reload. Let's go to dodge stance. Just gonna stay here in ambush stance. So we wanna get the rest of our zombies and stuff moved up. And she's gonna keep ambushing. You. Pretty good chance to hit, honestly. Really good with the aim option, obviously. Now let's do it. Oh, you rolled a 96. Ah, <laughs> uh, it's perfect. There we go. Oh, we crit this time. All right, we're making up for it. Freaking 95% chance to hit. Rolls a 96. Excellent. Oh, that sucks. Ah! Woof. That was a heck of a hit. I guess I could just have him, like, chill out here by this door for right now. Yeah, let's do that. Probably not quite have enough movement to get around, unfortunately. Mm, we gotta be careful with him. We don't want to, like... We want to make sure our ambush... You know what? Actually, we're just gonna... We're just gonna chill back here. We don't want to, like, run into the poison, obviously. Because he's not immune to it. Oh, is she gonna come around? Oh, she's climbing up over there, I guess? I have no idea where she just... She decided to just like jumped up over there, I, I suppose. Just ran off. Do, 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 do. I think this gal still has to move. Elma Jaeger. Oh, there she is. A new round has started. Prayer of swiftness. Oh, Comet. <gasps> Ow. Eh. 
And off she goes. <laughs> Drops a comment on my head and runs away. Oh, okay, she went over there. Gotcha. It's like just outside of my freaking. uh... What the heck is this? Why is my zombie invisible? Uh. Okay. Apparently my zombie has decided that he should no longer be apparated, and, uh... Okay, well, I hope... Oh, there we go. He's back. <laughs> that was weird. I refuse to have a character model. You can't tell me what to do. That gives you more attacks. As you level up, you gain more um, red globes or red pills. <laughs> um. <Oop. laughs> so initially, your zombies can only swing once, but then you're once you I think reach level three. I think it is. Um. You know the red pill, which allows you to swing twice. Yeah. Elma Kips. Yeah. Just giving her the, the big chops here. Alright, um. What we could do is we could just. Take an aim shot at her and try to remove her from the picture. Nice. Does that freeze up my vampiress to do something? So now we can just have her walk up over here. Yeah, we biffed it, unfortunately. We should get another attack. There we go. Alright, good damage. And dodge. We do have a couple guys trying to roll around our flank as well, but we also have dudes standing back here. Not really doing much, so I'm just have them chill out. Okay, you. You run up here. I'm gonna have you gather some, uh, gather some of this weird stone, seeing as how... Objectives updated. Seeing as you are able to gain warp attuned from that. Let's do Rotten Touch. Ah! my bow real fast. Question is, do I do more damage by shooting? The accuracy is way lower, that's for certain. Nice. There we go. Let's see how much... Um... Are we just gonna chill again then? Their morale is still doing well enough. That way I could get the casting power again. Send this guy around over here. Have him chill there, that way he can flank if he needs to. How much of the warp zone do we currently have? Uh, we need... We have three out of nine. All right, so. We're gonna have to start picking this stuff up and just, it's fragment. No, we don't want the fragment. We wanna get the shards if we Objectives can. Objectives updated. We'll have this guy be the. Okay, 11 HP, that's fine.
Objectives okay. updated. Another shard. It's the warp effect that we get. Reduce movement range. All right, well, that's honestly fine considering the... Objectives Considering updated. where we're at right now, we're already up in the enemy's face. We don't need to move super far. Now, now what warp effect did we get? Fred's weapon switch. That's also fine. Objectives updated. Now we didn't get any negative effects from that at all. Sweet. All right, so we're just going to have this guy hang out back here. He's, he's got a whole bunch of weird stones, so I don't want to have him lose any of it. Hey, bud. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Get clubbed. Or Sigmar. What's Sigmar ever do for you? They don't have all that much morale left. If they lose another couple guys, they're morale is probably going to break. A new round has started. Prayer of go fast. Hi. I'm a zombie. Ow. Uh... Just keeps chucking space rocks at me. Okay. Well. Check out this loot. What do we got here? Wow. Literally nothing. Nice. Good stuff. Let's do this. She's dodgy. Give her that. There we go. Right, this dude -er. Check the loot. She also had nothing. Did I check this other loot thing over here yet? Remember if I check this. Okay, nobody here has anything. They'll have taken the vow of poverty, apparently. Yeah, I'm working on completing it. I just don't need to like, rush it at the moment. I'm going to use this warp stone to uh, boost my necromancer. I only need two more. I'm just in no hurry to pick it all up at the moment. Ah! Woo! All right. Everybody that's up here is immune to poison currently, so... We will just toys... We'll just toys... By toys, I mean toss... A uh, poison globe up here. And then I guess it was dodge stance. All right, Super Jimbotron. Schmack. Schmack. And dodge. You. And parry. This is my, unfortunately, less leveled zombie, so he doesn't get the extra attacks. We're actually going to have her delay here. Oh my gosh. Jimbotron is a tricky madman. Dodging all over the place. Alright, let's get this weird stone shard. Objectives updated. Alright, this is negative effects he has right now. 
Plus one from spellcasting for instance, switch weapon. All right, that's fine. Let's pick up this last shard. Objective completed. That'll finish my secondary objective. Uh, who do I want to hit with this? Eh. Smack her around with. Rotten touch here. The hell? Negative 50% range resistance is the curse I got. Lovely. Thankfully, they don't have any ranged, so we don't have to worry about that, but still. Can I actually get in here to hit her? Oh gosh, I think I'm like, oh, it sucks. Well, I guess I could go around back the other way. Because I think there's a gap up here that I can get in. Yeah, there we go. Dodge stance. And that should finish her off. Ah! Provided we can actually connect. Ah! There we go. If we can hit. What do you got for loot, lady? Probably nothing. Oh, you got a great flail. Sweet. Thank you. I unfortunately can't use any flails, but... I'll happily sell it, because it's worth an okay amount of money. Alright, uh, this guy's inventory, I think it's full, isn't it? Yeah, he's it's full of warp stone already. So we'll just have him keep hanging out here. I think all these are just fragments that are on the ground now. Whoa, girly jankles. Look out, my dude. There's an angry person here. Sign of Sigmar. Just ambush stance. All right. A new round has started. Okay. Uh, what's this guy's inventory look like? I don't think he's picked anything up yet. Um, are these just all fragments now? It really looks like that is the case. We'll pick it up anyways. It's kind of interesting. Picked up the fragment and nothing happened. Just must just good die roll. It's literally nothing. <laughs> Resisted it. What kind of negative effects are we getting here? Uh, negative twenty percent armor absorption prevents switch weapons. The armor absorption one is pretty rough. Oh, positive warp effects. What did, what did we get? Ranged and melee resistance. Uh, that's not bad. Alright, well, our inventory's full now. Uh, so I guess we'll just kind of hang out here. You. Hit. If I kill her, it might break their morale, so... Let's see what happens here. Is that enough? Yeah, it should be enough. Parry stance. Um. Good angle to shoot from here. 
Take an aim shot, I guess. Sure. Reload. And end turn. Okay. Some pretty good damage we can lay down. Oh my gosh, crit. Beautiful. Two freaking two crits? Holy heck. He is not a fan of this. All right, well, let's go over here and gather more weird stone. Seeing as how it's all right here, we might as well try to pick up as much as we can before the enemy takes their uh, morale penalty or whatever. stone. Can I get close enough to gather this one? I can. Nice. That should actually be all the weird stone on the map, I think. I think I got all of it. Positive warp effect. Nice. Our negative is not that bad. <laughs> so, our negative is negative two meters movement range, and our positive is plus three meters movement range. So, we've netted a plus one in Toto. Okay. Uh, yes. We have claimed all of the weird stones. Beautiful. Do I actually have the movement? That plus one to get around to attack? Nah, I don't. Alright, whatever. I'll just chill here. We'll just chill here. How's it going, Wookie Cookie? <laughs> Fall down. Shield, jerk. Go an ambush stance, I guess. Um. still. Yeah, we'll go for an aim shot. <laughs> you see how that how that freaking arrow came off the bow? Holy, no wonder you missed. It's the worst form I have ever seen. Hi. Um, you have to forgive me. I know not what I do. I am but a ghoul. This guy is the dude that's like freaking jam packed full of warp stone, isn't he? Yes. Okay, so we want him to just chill out. I don't want there to be any risk whatsoever. Any risk whatsoever that he might die. Get ready for lose, a breakdown. Lose all that hoop stone. Uh, Boregor, thank you for that follow. Much appreciated. Hope you're doing well. All right, so we got a blue great flail and a great hammer. Unfortunately, we can't use great flails. Great flails are excellent, but we cannot use them. It is by deed that loyalty to Count Vlad is made manifest. Your triumph proves your devotion to Drakenhof. When the legions of Sylvania march on the mortals, your service to the master will not be forgotten. Dang, Skippy. There we go. Good job, Super Jibotron. Outstanding. Uh, good to see you playing this game. I've been enjoying it recently. Yeah, it's good fun. It's good fun. Um, Prided you're in, into... RNG, or you can you can understand RNG at least enough to not get super frustrated with it. I guess is <laughs> comes down to it's so it's so easy to 
to get mad when you miss freaking 95% chance to hits. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 3 X EXP for the optional objective. Yeah, nice. But if you played it, any form of tabletop gaming whatsoever, or if you're just fine with RNG, it's a really, really enjoyable title, honestly. The RNG is Warhammer's real. Yeah, I mean, if you do anything Warhammer related, you're pretty familiar with frigging RNG anyway, so... <laughs> Outstanding. Excellent. Nice progress. Nice progress. Outstanding. Good job, High Forts. You might be out of that yellow shirt yet. He got to level one. So he's no longer fully the new guy. Two one spun skill points. Nice. Fantastic. And this guy. Yeah, he needs to reach level three so he can get his um, extra red pill. And this guy will soon be Steve the Pirate. <laughs> and four for a decisive victory. Nice. What kind of extra items did we get? 26 crowns. 9x weird stone fragments, 6x shards, 3 clusters. We should be able to finish our our uh, ship in here as well, the Vlad. Alright. Management. Okay. Pay our upkeep. Disband Warband. Everybody out. Why is campaign locked? Because I have to have the day go by. You can only do one campaign mission per day. Um, so when you do a campaign mission, it moves the day forward, essentially. So I need to rest my guys, and then we can do another campaign mission. All right. We got to... We, let's go to Steve over here real quick and uh, rename him before I forget. Steve the Pirate. Boom. It is done. He is Steve. <laughs> okay, now we gotta do this. Um, up that alertness to bar, so he's got that crazy initiative. You, he's already at three int, so that's good. <laughs> leadership maxed out at three. Yes, zombies not known for their leadership skills. All right, so we want weapon skill, we want alertness, so he also has higher morale. Never took vampires and ghouls as a type to use axes. They're pretty good at it, <laughs> honestly. Friggin' hits hard, real hard. He's still training. There we go. He can get to three in, in now. Nice. Um, let's bring him to nine strength as well. And then increase his weapon skill. So, melee resist and melee hit chance. A little bit extra damage. And int. So, uh, we can get a skill that requires three int, basically. Otherwise, otherwise, there's not a lot of reason to put int on a zombie, obviously. <laughs> All right, this guy. Let's bring him to six strength. And then increase his initiative. More initiative, more weapon skill.
you more weapon skill, and you more initiative as well. High forwards over here. More Agi. Oh yeah, he's got two points. Two points in Agi. And then let's put another point in ballistic skill. Seeing as how he's shooting pistoles at people. What's the deal with a beret? Uh, it's a beret. Uh, there isn't any deal with it, I guess. <laughs> uh, weapon skill. Let's bring his int up to three. So that he can get that skill learned as well and bring his Agi up. So his dodge chance goes up and his mill resistance goes up as well. Steve the pirate. No pile won't give him free to you. Son of Bill. Yeah, there you go. I always used to play Bill when I did when I played Left 4 Dead. <laughs> Uh, let's see, so Agi on him, and alertness for the initiative. That's a throwback? Yeah, right? Used to play that game all the time. It's one of those that you get home, and you jump on and see if everybody else was playing, and then you freaking play for the evening or whatever. All right. Um, Dark Tide got delayed. Yeah, I mean, it's not overly surprising, honestly. But I would rather them delay it and it not be trash than have it come out and be trash and then, then spend the next freaking X amount of months to years patching it. That's true. Back for blood. Um, I'm not sure when that's supposed to release, but yeah, it's... Looks like that's coming along nicely. Alright, skills. Alright, we already have... We got weak spot, so we can get... Because we actually have int now, we can get knowledge tactics, which gives us dodge and parry chance. So we'll have him learn that. Does he have any skill points? He does not. She has a ton of skill points. We gotta be careful with our money, obviously. Let's give her knowledge tactics as well. Yeah, I'm pretty poor. I probably should not spend any more money on this stuff right now. Where did the chair cam go? The chair is, is hiding. And, uh, too much, uh, too much in the public eye yesterday. Expect a mod for your Left 4 Dead cast skins with a few days of release? Probably, yeah. Uh, I wouldn't be surprised at all. Alright, so we have... what? How many? We need 124 pounds and we can have 135. So let's do it. Or Get ready for a break in there. Uh, Mech Dog 2020. Thank you for the follow. Appreciate that. Try to get a Witch Hunter Warband off the ground and I'm having the worst time with it. I hear... I haven't actually played the Witch Hunters. Um... I hear they're strong, but I guess uh, maybe their early game sucks. I don't know. <laughs> Unfortunately, I won't be able to give you any advice because I haven't played them. So just yeah, we'll just give it all the blad. Send it all. All right. Once we finally get our shipment. Um. We'll get a bunch of money. What factions are there? Uh, so you have the Chaos Cultists, you have the Skaven, you have the Human Mercenaries, you have the Vampires, you have the Witch Hunters, um, and you have the Sisters of Sigmar. Okay. Uh, I think that's pretty much all we can do for this day. I think I right, two days on that. 
So we are going to rest. Confirm. Alright. Currently training Bullseye still. We're returning one days. Learn knowledge tactics. Learn knowledge tactics. And we got our shipment, which means we now have 963 gold. Yay, gold. These elves and dwarves. If they were going to continue supporting the game, there probably would have been more. So, like, the the Witch Hunters and uh, the Vampires are DLC factions. But I am pretty sure they're not actually, like, doing any more production on this game. So we won't get any more stuff, unfortunately. All right, one more day. I really wish we could use this Great Flail. Be so nice. I'll just ditch it for now. Go. That. Probably don't need five clothing. Like three probably would be alright. Or up two. Can't use flails either, so get rid of that. I guess we can hang on to the rest of this. Too high tier, the game is almost grabbing against some degenerates. Yeah, I could see, um, like, a DLC character. I don't know about a whole warband, but, you know, like, maybe a character or something that might be willing to engage in this nonsense. <laughs> Could <to> recruit me. <laughs> All right, I think we are pretty good to go here. This guy's got a turn yet before he comes back. I don't want to do the story mission until I have my full party back together, the band back together. Let's see what we have for campaign missions here. Average, average. One more burn caught exploring buildings while the other three is divided into strike teams. Weesh. That one's rough. Deadly. Exploring buildings, other points around the wagon. So, this one's probably the best one I can do yet, unless I pay for scouts. Um, I think I'm gonna swap my leader out so my other guy can get some more EXP here. Swap them out. Because he needs some. Needs some extra EXP to help him along. Because he doesn't have like any skills or anything like that. He's level zero still. So when my main leader has to go off and get trained on some big badass skills, I have a dude to stand in. Do it. Your scouts report to you that a rival warband has been spotted in the area pillaging houses. While they are dispersed and distracted, you deploy your own patrols in the hope of surprising the enemy. Dang straight we do. But before we do that, I'm going to go get some more water. I need to use the latrine, so I'll be right back, chat, and then we'll get this uh, mission going. So thank you so much for watching. Hope you guys are enjoying.